Any baby. My favorite shoes. The hat. Uh, uh, these are DMP 11s. 11s are my favorite shoe of all time. Black and red 11s are my favorite ones. Yeah, the gold though, too. See the gold on it? Can I see the gold on my hat? Yeah, they're a little yellow. I do wear my DMPs. If you have some DMPs, you should wear I start with the Conqueror. It just came out in 2000. Or 2001. But yeah, these are yellow a little bit. I have one. And, but they're, pretty, they're in pretty good shape, I think. Judging by the age. And, and I got the Concord, the ones that recently came in 2011. I told myself if I get two pairs of these, then I'm gonna stop buying Jordans like forever. I didn't have to wait in line or you know camp out or anything like that. And I got some cool grades. They're from 2001, and also some cool grades that came out. And I have some Space Jams here. I haven't worn these. I didn't get them when they came out the first time they came out, but. Um, yeah, I have them now. All the ones in the back are all dead stock. Dead stock means they haven't been worn. These haven't been worn. You can lick them. And along to my favorite shoes, the black and red 11s. These came out in 2001. I did have to wait in line for these. I think I got there at like 6 in the morning and I had to wait for them. This is the first shoe I've ever waited in line for. When I was in high school, I didn't have to wait in line for shoes because I had a friend that that uh, was a manager at a shoe store, he would hold my size, size 12. This is my ones collection. So here's my royal blue ones. These are from 2001. And these are dead stock. I actually got these in the trade. I traded a pair of black hat fours, all black fours. For a pair of these dead stock, I guess the guy didn't know what, what he really had. And see, there's 50,000 of them made, and that's number 6,288. So, I don't know, these are 10 years old. I don't know when I'm gonna bust them out, but you know when these days I'll bust them out. They still smell fresh too. These are the Jordan 1 new lows. These are Jordan 1s. Um, these came out in 2003, or, no, 2002. Um, but yeah, these are when they originally came out. They came out a few years ago, I think in 2009 or something like that. But they were all white right here. Um, but these are when they first came out. And when I first saw these, I loved these shoes, and I still do. They're pretty beat up, you know, they're yellow. They're kind of yellow around the sole and they're kind of coming apart right here, but I still wear them and I love these shoes. If anybody has a size 12, 12 and a half, 13 in these uh, that are still dead stock with the red around here, just let me know because I would love to buy them. These came out in 2005. Uh, they came out on jumpman23.com. It was online only release. And then they came out with a t-shirt and hat they were limited i don't exactly know how many pairs were, were released the great fives everybody wanted the great fives when they came out um they caused a lot of commotion everywhere these are actually dead stock i never wore these or tried them on i was lucky to get a pair of these from chic the mall out here in concord they have one store that was going to get them and they only had one size run so they had about eight pairs and only one size 12 and I was lucky to be able to get a pair of these. They took my name down. I didn't have to wait in line or camp out or anything. I just showed up to the mall the next day when they released and I was able to get a pair and there was about 500 people in line waiting for them. They didn't get a pair. I was one of the eight to get a pair. The Jordan 2s. These came out 2004. These were when I was in high school. A lot of people hate on the twos. I love the twos. They're so comfortable. They're like one of the most comfortable Jordans. And last but not least is the DMP sixes. Winner, stack it up until it's fall, then I'm looking like a winner. Them people act for it, so 
know how to do my thing. We don't do them losing streaks because we out to get a rank. So that's when they see the lightning, meaning I'm going to start my reign. Out the win it to begin it, so I'm going to start the game. You ain't never seen something, and they show you what's the meaning. Wash them polish up the whip, then we call it spring cleaning. Wash it all off, courtesy of April showers. Breaking down and rolling up the best of Mother Nature's flowers. A hundred miles an hour when I weaving through the traffic on a march. Man, this run victory is how we cap it. Put the trophy up, make it toast to it. We make our own rules, this ain't how most do it. When it hit us heat, I bet they lose their cool. Saying you don't like this, then it must be. Some more shoes, these are the laser Lundy dunks. They only made 2,500 pairs of them. And I have one pair. I'm gonna do my thing. 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 You should do the same. I say right around spring. That's when I start to rain. So I'm gonna do my, I'm gonna do my, I'm gonna do my thing. I actually picked these up at the outlets last year. Somebody, I guess, returned them. I got lucky. They only cost $90. They don't have the clear bottom. They're not the pewters. The Donchfell Willis Dunks. These came out on Nike.com only. They were inspired by the pitcher from the Marlins. As you can see, you know, that's him pitching on the mound right there. I do have a pair of Jordan 9s. They're the olive colorway. They're infantized. So I have to find a future ex big mama. So you can have your baby. I have a son to, to wear these. Um, I want to find a pair of these in a size 12 or you know, 12 to 13. So you can trade me for some photos. Mm -hmm. 